we have to take into consideration that this is the largest senior citizen block. We've got 142 flats. The other blocks, one has 69, 71, and 72. Our problem is that ever since this was inaugurated eight years ago, we asked for the implementation of the wardens to be like that of Bishop Canilla, which already had the three wardens employed. At that time, we had the GSD government, and into the last minute we went with them, everything had been agreed that the wardens were going to be put exactly the same as in Bishop Canilla. Uh, the elections came about, everything changed. Since then, I have been going to meetings uh, pra practically every three months with the first the housing minister who used to be Mr. Balvan, now it's Mr. Sacramento, and every time I've gone to a meeting, I've raised this problem. Every time I had been told that it was being looked into, was being looked into. We've been wait we waited for nearly six years with no results. I've contacted the Minister Sacramento asking why the delay with us. The last meeting with her was about nine months ago. She showed me that everything was in order, that the rotation was going to be implemented and that the wardens will rotate between the four blocks. We were very happy with that. We thought that was going to come along like nine months ago. Since then, I've been writing to them, I've been trying to get hold of them. All I get, it's been looked into, it's been looked into, but nothing has been, nothing has, has been done. And uh, what function do wardens carry out? Why are they so important? Wardens very much needed in the senior citizen block. For exact, for, they take care of all the flats, they help a lot with the senior citizens, and uh, if they've got a breakage, or if they've got if they need assistance, whatever, the wardens are the main thing here in this block, especially since we've got a lot of disability people and sometimes they help down with the, with the wheelchairs or the lifts, the lifts tend to break down a lot. And the wardens are there to, for everything, they are needed for everything. What's the reason you've been given for this delay? None. I'm still waiting, that's why I'm writing now to the chief minister. And the letter I've got in front of me, which is going in the Chronicle as well, I'm sending it to the chief minister and it's for the attention because I've, I've asked for meetings with him for the last three months. I haven't even had a reply. I haven't had a reply, neither accepting my, my request nor telling me why I can't have a meeting with him. And the, the reason I want to find out is why, why is Albert House different to the other three blocks? As you mentioned, it's been eight years. Uh, why have you gone public with this complaint now? Because I think that's the last ultimatum we've got. We've been trying to be nice, we've been trying to hold on, and especially since the other two blocks had not been built, we took it for granted that something was being done. But then the other two blocks are allocated, and we find out that they've got the three wardens' method, so what's, what's wrong with Albert Ritzel House?